Made Kinder Music, Lesson 16. Good morning, Kinder Kids. It's wonderful to see you again. We've seen a lot of exhibits at the God Made Kinder Music Zoo so far, but there's one exhibit we haven't visited yet. Any guesses which one it is? Hmm, let me think. We've been to the penguin exhibit because that's where we learned that music can be soft, like this. And then we visited the polar bear's pond where we learned that music can be loud like this. We loved watching Dash the Dashhound round up those wild horses. And that's when we learned that music can be fast like this. Let's not forget about slow music, like the kind we heard when we tried to get that slow green turtle back to the petting zoo. Gerald and Sally, that's an excellent review of what we've learned about music so far. Today, we're going to learn something else about music. And here's a hint about where we're going next to learn it. Does anyone remember this music? We heard it way back at one of our first visits to the zoo. Oh, Mr. Z, I recognize that music. It sounds soft and slow. Yes, it does, Sally. And I think it sounds watery, too. Well, Gerald, that's because the aquarium has lots of water. And that's where we're going next. Make sure to bring your workbooks and your Gerald Jr. puppets because we're going to teach Gerald Jr. that when musical notes step up or down next to each other, they act like neighbors and make the music sound smooth and connected. On the way to the aquarium, we'll pass several animal displays. Give a big wave to Eddie the Elephant at his watering hole. Eddie, I see you're enjoying spraying water everywhere. Look out, Kinder Kids. He might just try to spray you for fun. <laughs> that Eddie is sure a prankster. We'd better hurry out of the reach of his spray. And right over there is the petting zoo. I'm sure glad to see those chickens back where they belong. I did not like sharing my barn with them. It took all of us giraffes to gather them up and get them back to the petting zoo. And there's that slow green turtle. took a leisurely stroll to the lake before returning to his pond in the petting zoo. And here we are at the aquarium, Kinder Kids. Some of you may have aquariums in your home for your pet fish, but this aquarium is really huge. Oh my, look at all of the fish. I've never seen so many at one time before. And look at all of the different and beautiful colors. I see every color of the rainbow on those fish. Kinder kids, 
While we listen once again to the aquarium music, why don't you make your Gerald Jr. puppets swim, just like all of the fish that we see around us? <laughs> your puppets were swimming all over the place. Let's give them a rest now while you turn to page 14 in your workbooks. First of all, let's use a purple crayon to color the fish swimming downward at the bottom of the page on line 7. Pretend the fish are musical notes that are swimming down to the bottom of the aquarium. I'm going to play music that matches the downward direction the fish are swimming while you color. The Gerald Jr. puppet will show you which notes are playing. Uh, Sally, would you like to choose a color for the fish that are swimming upward on line six? Oh, I'd love to, Mr. Z. How about yellow? They look like they're swimming up to the sunlight. And while you kinder kids color the fish swimming upward, I'll play music that sounds like it's moving upward, too. Uh, once again, Gerald Jr. will show you which notes are being played. Alright Gerald, it's your turn. Choose a color for the fish at the very top of the page on lines 1 and 3. Those fish are making a pattern of swimming that goes up and down, up and down, up and down. I'll play notes that go up and down like the swimming fish. What color do you want to choose, Gerald? How about red, Mr. Z? That's a great fish color. It sure is. A kinder kids, while you color these fish red, listen to how notes sound when they move up and down. We only have two more fish patterns left, Kinder Kids. What do you think about using blue to color the next fish pattern under the red fish? Yay! Notice how this pattern on lines two and four goes up, then down, and then up and up again. Listen to what the notes playing that fish pattern sound like in music while you color those fish blue. As always, Gerald is ready to help you again. Okay, Kinder Kids. There's only one swimming fish pattern left. Let's see. Why don't we color those fish green? The pattern on line five goes up, then down, then up, 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 up. Listen to the music that follows that pattern while you color. Look at that, Kinder Kids. You've made a beautiful page of fish in the aquarium. 
After all of this practice coloring the fish's swimming patterns, I think the kinder kids should do a performance of the whole thing for everyone at the zoo. What do you say, kinder kids? Would you like to do that? That's a great idea, Sally. I'll put a sign up that says Aquarium Music Concert in five minutes. Uh, then I'll go around the zoo and tell everyone to come hear the aquarium music performed by the Kinder Kids and their Gerald Jr. puppets. Sounds like a good plan to me, Gerald. That'll give us just enough time to get ready. Once the concert begins, the Gerald Jr. puppets can swim all around the aquarium with all of the fish. Everyone is gathering around so they can hear the aquarium concert. That's great! Then let's go, Kinder Kids. Get your puppets ready. And a one, and a two, and swim! just knew the animals and guests would go wild with applause when you kinder kids performed the aquarium music. You were right, Sally. I believe this was one of the most fun things that we've done here at the zoo. And sharing it with others is what we should do with the music that God gave us. Mr. Z, we can remember what we've learned today this way. Music is soft and loud, fast and slow. Follow the neighbor's stepping notes wherever they go. There's never been a musical zoo that made learning about music so much fun. Thank you all for your participation today. All of that watery music has made me thirsty. Let's celebrate our well-done musical performance by going to the snack shop for a cool, refreshing bottle of water.
Thank you.